Today, I'm bringing you groundbreaking and delightful news from Ghana's automotive sector. The nation of Ghana has just launched its first ever 60 kilowatt solar powered electric vehicle charging station. In partnership with the likes of the German Agency for International Cooperation and other private sector agencies, this is a bold leap towards incorporating electric vehicles to be part and parcel of Ghana's automotive landscape. Electric vehicles are cleaner, greener, and more sustainable for the future of the country. This project is set to transform transportation and put Ghana's pursuit of electric vehicles on a new pedestal. So today, I'll be giving you all the details on Ghana's first ever electric vehicle charging station, just launched, why it's such a big deal and how it's going to reshape our nation's future. But before we delve in, smash the like button and hit the subscribe button and also hit the notification bell for more updates on Ghana's bold leap into the future. Let's get right into this information. The Energy Commission's head office in Accra was filled with excitement as Ghana unveiled its first ever 60 kilowatt solar powered electric vehicle charging station. This historic project is a joint effort by the Energy Commission and the Ministry of Energy and Green Transition, and it marks a turning point into Ghana's journey towards sustainable transportation. The station Powered by 105 solar panels, generating 61.43 kilowatts peak, is a beacon of innovation designed to reduce our reliance on fossil fuels. The visionary leadership behind this project sees it as a cornerstone of a broader strategy to modernize public transportation, harness Ghana's abundant sunlight to power the future. This electric vehicle charging station is a hub for research, is a hub for research, innovation, and collaboration, bringing together government private sectors and global partners like the German Agency for International Cooperation. Ghana is saying we are ready to dive into electric vehicles and the ambition is infectious, sparking pride across the nation. One might ask that, why is this charging station such a massive deal? It's about powering a green revolution and reclaiming Ghana's environmental future. Urban pollution, high fuel cost and dependence on imported fossil fuel have long burdened our cities and wallets. The 60 kW solar powered station, backed by a 60 kW hour lithium ion battery bank, offers a cleaner, cheaper alternative, fueling electric vehicles with renewable energy. Now the past effort to curb emissions haven't been successful, but this project is a game changer as it aligns with the global goals for sustainable energy and climate action. It's a bold step to make Ghana's road cleaner and also our air fresher, setting a model for Africa at the same time utilizing electric vehicles gliding through Accra, cutting the smog and cost. This is a brilliant move to electrify our future and also inspire our nation. And even if it's not widely accepted immediately, it will gradually bring electric vehicles into the country's enclave. The solar power charging station, with the 80-90% to 90 lower environmental impact than grid power chargers, is a lifeline for Ghana's climate goals and by harnessing the solar energy, it will reduce carbon emissions and promote energy independence, freeing us from volatile fossil fuel market. The station is designed with 105 solar panels as earlier reported and a robust battery backup. It ensures reliable power even off-grid, making it a model for sustainable mobility. Electric vehicles are much needed for the vibrant cities to make their skies cleaner, where electric vehicles will replace the smoky engine, way more quieter and it's an environmental rocket, launching the nation towards a net zero future. The charging station is set to make waves across Africa as Ghana is now introducing it into its country and later with neighbors adopting this model. With Togo and Burkina Faso hopefully next, it will position itself as a hub for green transportation. The electric station's solar-powered model, developed with partners like the German Agency for International Cooperation, sets a standard for the region, inspiring countries to adopt renewable energy for mobility. Just imagine electric vehicles crossing borders, powered by Ghana's model. This is Ghana stepping up as Africa's green transport leader and its peer dynamite. Beyond charging electric vehicles, it will serve as a demonstration site and research hub, collecting data to scale up EV adoption collecting data to scale up electric vehicle adoption across Ghana. Partnerships with global investors bring cutting-edge technology, while the local institutions and private companies test new solutions. The hub focuses on analysis and knowledge sharing ensuring success. The visionary leadership sees it as a catalyst for collaboration, inspiring startups and researchers to push boundaries. Various entrepreneurs will be working together, developing electric vehicle solutions for Ghana's roads, and this will be a hub of progress. This first ever charging station in Ghana 
will transform the country. Local businesses near the Energy Commission's head office will thrive as electric, as electric vehicle drivers stop to charge, boosting vendors and shops. This is said to be the first of many charging stations across the country, and the country very much acknowledges how this is going to transform the nation. The youth in tech will also gain training in green technology, while enterprises supply services to the hub. This will all ensure that it boosts the locals and also engages in the buy-in. Social media is buzzing with excitement as they praise this station's rule as it will ensure the mass introduction of electric vehicles into the country. Accra streets will be humming with electric vehicles. The kids will also be breathing cleaner air without the smog that comes out of petrol and diesel engines. This station is the spark for communities and is pure breathing it is very much appreciated by the Ghanaian community. This charging station is also a testament to Ghana's unyielding spirit as the past energy initiatives struggled with funding and coordination. But this solar power station marks a bold rebirth. It is backed by the Energy Commission and the global partners as earlier stated as it embodies Ghana's commitment to a sustainable future. The station symbolizes the resilience, learning from past setbacks to build a cleaner tomorrow. Electric vehicles powered by the sun is even more of a renewable solution than other charging stations that end up using fossil fuels such as generators or using plants. Ghana faces pollution and fuel cost, but the global momentum for electric vehicles creates a window of opportunity. Partnerships with innovators like the German Agency for International Cooperation make the project even more ideal bringing expertise and resources. The station's research focus will also drive electric vehicle adoption, addressing urban challenges. This is more than a charging station, as it's a revolution transforming transportation and making Ghana's road cleaner and more sustainable. By promoting electric vehicles, it will support for a healthier city and global climate goals. The hub's research will spark innovation. While the communities are very much excited about the opportunities this brings, Ghana's first ever 60 kilowatt solar powered electric vehicle charging station is taking off, launching our nation into a future where electric vehicles are very common and the country is greener with a cleaner future with innovation and pride. This is the government of Ghana doing what we suppose of it, pioneering epic wins for every citizen and partnering with international corporations to ensure the country go to ensure the country progresses into the new age. What do you think about this first ever 60 kilowatt solar powered electric vehicle charging station which has just been launched in the country? Drop your thoughts in the comment section below and also smash the like button as it helps inform more people about this project's launch and subscribe for more updates on Ghana's transformation. Check out this next video also as we bring you more transformative projects coming to you right here in Ghana. Thank you and on to the next video. Be sure to check this next video out.